Mega Man Zero video. This is part six. And uh, before I begin, I'm going to show you how to use Cyber Elves. Okay, so we're at the. You have to be at the trans server. And then, uh, when you first get a Cyber Elf, some of them need to be fed. And uh, this took a lot of grinding. You need a lot of E crystals to in this first Mega Man Zero game. Um, so that took me a long time. Um, let's see, can I feed any other ones? Oh yeah, you can see I only have a hundred left, and they all take like at least a thousand or something. Except maybe I'll get them next time. But anyway, so then you want to download your elf, and then. None of my other elves are ready yet. But here we go. After you download your elf, you're gonna go to the elf section on the menu and use it. There we go. My health bar is bigger. I will grind some more for some more e-crystals. But yeah. So anyway, the first mission we're going to take on today will be the destroy the train mission. Okay. We s we're so basically we're just trying to destroy the enemy train and stop their supplies from coming in. So that way they're much weaker enemies. All right, let's do this. Time to attack. And there's some e crystals here. If you were wondering, and you can't go that way, so you have to go this way. What I like about Z Zero One, they didn't do this in any of the other games that I've played. I've only played like a few levels of each one because no, I wasn't that good at it. But now I'm just like, yeah, but, but this is the only game where all of the levels are the are intertwined, I believe, or all these stages. But, but to get around, you just want to cut these things out. Very helpful with the. The rope, or the spinny thing, <laughs> sorry. And, uh, I just said that because I don't actually know the comments about me being intertwined. I don't actually know where that train station is. So I'm just bringing it up because I know it's the exact opposite. Oh. <laughs> I guess I already beat up that mini boss just really quick. You just gotta have the electric, the electric chip and full charge it, it'll freeze while it's standing back, and then you're good to go. Just hit it. For this one, you only have three minutes, which should be no problem. Um, so just get across the stage. You can see I'm already halfway there. Yeah, it's a really strong stage. says the mission was a success because of me? Is there anything that these other resistance members can do without me? I mean, I am doing all the missions here. They're all dying or doing nothing. Well, anyway, we got this cyber elf. So I guess we can get a cool ability from her. Her, I guess. When she grows up. But, I'll be right back. So the resistance base, so they're being hacked. 
and we have to go back to that hidden base in the desert, which we all remember. We had to go there a few times. Like, four times. Not, not the base, but the desert. Anyway. Yes, I remember where the entrance is. And let's go. This mission is actually pretty easy. Um, this place. Don't want to go too quickly down here. And that was really close. Just gotta destroy those things. Continue. You don't really want to go down there. I already explained this when we first came here, but you don't really want to mess with those things. Huh. Okay, that was close. I learned my lesson there. Um, when you're trying to hit those things, try not to try not to saber hit them when they're really close to you. Just run through here. You get squiddy things. Which I think is a worse thing to do. But just try not to get crushed. It's pretty easy this one. Just go all the way to the end. I missed that cyber for some reason. Come on. Okay, here we go. Top of the ship. Oh no. Oh. Hold on a minute. Wait, 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 wait. You see that R there? That that R? Does it looks similar to the uh, Ripple Force at all? Maybe this is an old Ripple Force ship? I don't know. Maybe. It's familiar with all that yellow. Yeah, I fell. Where am I supposed to go? That was that was close. Um, where am I supposed to go? Oh, okay. I, I think I got it. I just paused the game for the, for the recording. I believe. I'm so. Wait, what? Okay, I, I guess there's an extra life up there or something. Nothing at all. Yeah, I. I <laughs> you do know that I record my narrations after I play. But. <sighs> and there we go. You do have to jump to the other ship, which is what I didn't record. So you know that one room that we couldn't get into earlier? Well, you can go there. And I believe there are some cell rooms in these, er, in these little prison cell areas now. So I'm gonna go ahead and get those. There. There. Okay. Taking forever. I just unlock the door and then mess up all these computers with your Z saber. I just heard the computer. So just destroy them. They're pretty easy. Just slash them a few times. Some of them give you extra lives, which I kind of like. Some of them give you cyber elves. Alright. There we go. Like I said earlier, there are some side rolls around here, and I'm going to try to get them. So just go to all of the old prison cells. Some of them have energy crystals, but hey, it's still worth it. Energy crystals. Still, you, you want to treasure your energy crystals, because they take forever to find. I 
like I'm not kidding. I spent oh, quite a while just grinding off screen. Like maybe 15 minutes just grinding, doing nothing at all. I believe there's a cycle for this one. At this point in time that this video is released, I am not an experienced commentator, so I don't know what to do when I'm not talking about the level. So I'm just gonna talk about the talk. So that makes sense. I don't actually know. I'm just trying to get through something that's not to the company in the comments. Oh no. Okay, well we've reached pretty much the end of the level. Until the boss, of course. So, two more. If you want it. I don't think they're too useful. But, the end of the level. Oh no, a massive energy reading. That's always good. No! Oh, oh, that was too close. I did not want to die there. We are the second guardian. My name is a Leviathan, one of the four guardians of Master X. Alright, I won't come back at all. And you're not going to be a computer. So here we are. We see the fighters jumping around. So don't equip the electric like I did. I realized my mistake before it was too late. tries, not too bad. But here we are. She kind of reminds me of... what was it? Hold on, I'll be right back. I'm gonna look something up. Okay, sorry about that. I'm back. Um, I believe it was Splash Woman I was trying to refer to. With her attacks. Very similar look. So now that I know there are two platforms, you can just keep jumping from side to side. And then, it'll be fine. Just don't equip the electric chip. And, yeah. We'll be good to go. Just keep jumping from side to side and avoiding all of those ice things. Like, okay, so if you stay on this side while she sends out all the ice things, uh, most of the ice things will be on that side. So you're pretty much safer to go to the other side. That's pretty self explanatory. Except for now, but usually I would just stay in the corner all the way over here and then just I. Uh, Round slash them, or spin slash, um, whatever you prefer. And that was too close to call. Like, was it close to call? Is that call too close? Oh, well, anyway, we're almost at the end, and here we are. <laughs> yes, I'm showing you mercy. I'm not showing you mercy, actually. That's the game. The game is letting me kill you! Just grab the cyber elf. Thankfully, the game lets you move around after you collect the Cyber Elf, so you don't fall in the spikes. That was nice. But, yeah, that's nice. Substitute energy. We'll learn about that later. But, we'll just save. And then I'll have to say peace. And sheep. Goodbye, people.